Hi and welcome to Jim's Radio Shop and uh, we're going to be installing some filter capacitors in this Zenith AM FM radio. So, um, this of course uh, radio has high voltages and what I really want to do is avoid having lots of high voltage contact points in the radio uh, that aren't necessary. So, so this is the high voltage wire on this capacitor. Now the original capacitor is back in here and it's a four part capacitor but I'm gonna bridge the uh, largest and the first part with a fairly large capacitor here. Uh, this one's a 68 microfarad. The radio uh, calls for an 80 microfarad and I just don't have one. Um, this guy should do the trick. You're gonna have to see. And But I don't want to kind of work it in way back here. So I found that there's a wire that runs over to this point and making this point the very same as that point. So I'm going to connect the uh, connect it here. Something something like that. And then this other line is going to go to ground. And here's a good good spot from this other capacitor someone else has installed. You see on their capacitor they didn't cover this wire. So I now I don't know what voltage is on there, but I can pretty much guess it's a big one, and uh, it might have been better to cover it with some kind of some kind of rubber hose. quite nicely like that. Let me take a look at that. appears to just simply be, be two wire connections that are close together and kind of confusing to look at. Trying to uh, yeah, understanding what you're seeing. At least for me.
Verify, that's the negative, that's the positive. Position this back this way. That's pretty good. It's a little springy. I think we should operate this head and uh, see what effect that's had. Uh, I've operated it before, putting in this capacitor, and uh, it's just a non stop pump. And no reception at all. Maybe because of other reasons. It could just simply be because of lack of antenna. But last time around, all I got was pretty ugly, huh? Okay, quick safety check. Nothing funny going on here. I need it ready. Now we're going to start it up on a current limited supply. There we go. this neon neon bulb not a regular light bulb an actual neon bulb Now, let's try tuning it. Sound very good. Let's keep tuning. In my uh, shop, it's very hard to pick up stations. Oh, man. Okay, let's, let's try it. Ooh. It's a little loud. I think this is probably FM. Hmm. Well, in terms of hum performance, uh, it's greatly improved. <clears throat> I can still hear a 
bit of a low hum, so it might have to it might have to put in a little more uh, a few more capacitors. It was a four section power supply capacitor here, and I've only boosted up the one section. Disappointing thing is it doesn't seem to be receiving anything. So let's uh I think I'll make that the topic of another next video. Thanks for watching the capacitor installation and test.